I decided to play music in the vineyards after um, it's always a part of the sensation, you know, uh, when you live inside and uh, uh, you have this sensation of uh, music is nice, music is a part of us, music is mat, music is something completely connected to to nature and is naturally existing. Look at the insects uh, differently in timing, but it's music as well. And uh, one day I found a guy who was uh, listening to the music from lips, uh, having a very stupid and simple machine you can find on internet that is able to read, to listen the, 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 the lymph, the, the, the lymph of the, the plants uh, passing into the leaves and translating in MIDI and then audio file. And so we listen the different kind of varieties with simple, simple machine. And every, every variety, in my case was vines, of course, but you can even listen the roses. Um, every variety has the similar, the, the, the same music, even changing the plant. The, the music of Corvina is the music of Corvina that uh, actually is the most, uh, the most, uh, the happiest. Um, then uh, Corvina is a bit slower. Osireta is very slow, uh, but intense. And so we play with that. And so uh, after this inspiration, because then we started to play music and listen to the reaction of the of the vine, uh, we decided this is absolutely not scientific. It's just my idea and my experience uh, to create a playlist during the winter. is more uh, oriented with the music is more oriented on percussions in order to get deeper in the soil to the roots. Because you know when it's uh, winter, the forces uh, are not going up for the sun. Uh, um, demand, but are going down to to save themselves and to give more power to the the the, the earth and to uh, be enriched by the the substance during the sun during the, the winter. And so we give this music a sort of a helping or giving a more rhythm in going down. And so it's most percussions um, during the summer uh, during the springtime we give something more happy. And so we start with Vivaldi and Mozart, because also they play in a 432 megahertz, that is the, the rhythm, the, the, the frequency of the nature, or even the, the, the heart. And so it's a more happiness. And then in the, in the, the summertime, we go uh, in something more, this is my idea, eh? a more um, Pink Floyd, John Coltrane, because they played some uh, something in that 432 megahertz also. And I decided that it's uh, quite nice. We see also that the frequency of the light, that the leaves uh, play very well, very soft, they're happy. But then it's four years that I'm experimenting this stuff. And I saw that it's accelerating, it's acceler it's accelerating a bit too much the life. But it's not that bad because we started 15 days before in pruning. But so I reduce from uh, six hours per day to four hours per day because maybe also, and I change more often uh, the music uh, because they could be tired, bored, uh, always the same music every day. And uh, always taking into consideration they are living beings. And so in some way they have some, uh, something similar to us. And uh, this is my idea, but uh, just my idea, crazy idea. So. Even if I see there is some difference, some effect, and um, I don't know if this is the right way, but uh, I'm looking forward to go ahead to discover more, more things. Maybe in 10 years we'll tell you something different. Uh, let's see.